Hello my beautiful viewers. <coughs> well as you can see from the intro this is another film review. The Warriors. Uh, a 1975 action uh, crime drama. Run it run time 1 hour 30 minutes. Uh, set in New York. About this gang from uh, from uh, Coney Island. <coughs> they all have a big meeting in uh, just one second. <coughs> this is the uh, the plot. Cyrus, leader of the Gramercy Riffs, the most powerful gang in New York City, requests that each of the city's gangs send nine unarmed delegates to Van Cortland Park for a midnight summit. The Warriors, a multiracial gang from Coney Island, attend the summit. Cyrus proposes to the assembled crowd a citywide truce and alliance that would allow the gangs to control the city together since they uh, collectively outnumber the police by three to one. Most of the gang members applaud the, this idea, but Luther, the unbalanced and sadistic leader of the rogues, shoots Cyrus dead as police officers uh, arrive to raid the summit in the ensuing chaos. Luther realizes that one of the warriors, Fox, appears to suspect him and makes a false accusation which leads the vengeful wrist to attack the war warlord Cleon. Meanwhile, the other warriors escape unaware that they have been implicated in Cyrus's killing. The wrist put out a hit on the warriors through radio DJ Swan. The war chief takes charge of the group as they try to get home. Uh, though the warrior's main enforcer and brawler Ajax disagrees with Swan being leader over him. The Turnbull ACs spot the Warriors and try to run down with a modified school bus, but the Warriors escape aboard on an elevated train. On the ride to Coney Island, the train is stopped by a building fire alongside tracks stranding the Warriors in Tremont. Setting out on foot, they encounter the orphans. Uh, well, basically, they set up all these. They're trying to get home, and they encounter all these different gangs, and uh, along the way, uh, until they get back to Coney Island. And spoiler alert! Spoiler alert! Spoiler alert! In the end, you find out that it wasn't the Warriors who uh, who who, did, who who killed the guy, and uh, uh, revenge is is served. But to me, it's uh, uh, this one of my favourite films of all time. You know what I can say, 10 out of 10, 10 out of 10. With a gold star and off the charts. This film is off the charts, 1979. It's a classic, absolute classic. <coughs> it's, the, the music's great, uh, what have you. And the, the, the version I've got, they've added, I comic book things into it as well that come up comic book pictures of the gang which wasn't on the original as well so it's a brilliant film it's i highly recommend it if you like gang films this is what uh, one of the classics and what have you it really and truly is an absolute off the charts classic the warriors 1979 runtime one hour 30 minutes if you haven't seen it you should watch it because it's a bloody gem, absolute gem. Anyway, so if you like this uh, review of The Warriors 1979, please subscribe to my channel and drop a comment. Thank you.